Good day everybody. Today we're going to do lesson plan 14, grade 4, term 2, and the topic is round off length. Um, here you got your link to the caps. Um, here we then have our resources that we can plan for. Um, we have some of our did you know questions, um, and then we have our dictionary works for today. Um, please pause and go through these. Then we're going to do our mental maths activity. So again, you're going to ask 10 questions. Um, it's again mixed times tables. And they're going to answer it. You're going to pause. Um, and then I'm revealing the answers. Mark. And then we can carry on with the next of the lesson. Okay. So um, then today's topic is round of length. Um, so... When we say I have a string of 99 centimeters, it's easier to say I have a string of more or less one meters. So let's quickly look at the examples. So what we're going to do is we're going to look at rounding off centimeters. Um, we're going to round off to meters and we again going to look at rounding off at meters. Um, these are just what we're going to do. Um, and then I'm going to take you then to the worksheet. You can pause and go through this, but on the worksheet, it's going to explain to us step by step. So let's quickly see here. So what we need to do is I need to round off six millimeters. So the first thing is I need to ask, and this is again is where your ruler plays such an important part is six, in, six millimeters is between which centimeters so six millimeters is between zero and one i just enlarged this so we can see where is it so six is between zero and one so here is six so we're going to round it off to the one centimeters what if we got three millimeters so we, if we got three millimeters we're going to round it off to zero centimeters So let's look at this example then. So we got 17 millimeters. So I know 17 millimeters lies between 1 centimeter and 2 centimeters. Again, showed on your ruler. So I'm going to find 17. So I know this is 15, 16, 17. So if I'm going to round it off to centimeters, it's going to be 2 centimeters. Again, it's, it must be practical. You need to give them rulers or number lines like these. So let's look then at 12 millimeters. So 12 millimeters, it's there. So if we round it off, it's closer to one centimeter. I want you to pause and do this example then practically. Okay, welcome back. So what we're going to do is we're going to round off to the nearest meter. So here again, we got 40 centimeters. So from zero to one, it represents one meters. So what we have 40, so we got 10, 20, 30, 40. So 40 will be here. So if we're going to round it off, we're going to round it to zero meters. But if we got 80, it will we will round it off to one meter so again here if i got 650 so this is 500 600 650 will be there in the middle so if i round it off to the nearest meter it will be seven meters or if i round it off to the nearest centimeters it will be 700 centimeters so make use of what i gave you here on these Number lines, if it's too small, make the drawings. Again, if you make drawings of number lines, do it with the child so they can understand why you're doing it. So what I want you to do is to pause and then to do this example. How more practically you do it, how easy it's to understand. Then here again, you're also going to round off to the nearest meter so what we have now is we have millimeters to meters 
So here what we do is we need to count in 100, 100, 200, 300, 400. So it's closer to 0 meter, but where you're 800 millimeters, it's closer to 1 meters. So I want you to pause and then do question number 3. Then what you're going to do is you're going to do the problem solving, um, your extra activity, um, always coming from old papers. Um, this might be a bit challenging because of after the comma, but ask them, ask them how did they get those measurements. Then we have some did you know here and then consolidation. If you got all yeses, um, you carry on with the next lesson. If you've got no's, you revisit some questions, activities, um, or you contact us at SA Teacher. Mm -hmm.